Are you worried that AI is going to replace many American jobs? No, that worry you? no, no. It's going to create tremendous numbers of jobs. It's going to also uh, create a lot of benefits medically for cancer research and other things. It's going to have a huge positive impact. And, you know, we want to be ahead of China. We're right now way ahead of China. Uh, David Sachs is one of the all-time experts. You know, the people are amazed that he, he just met him. I don't know if he's still here. There he is. But, uh, but one of the most respected people in that world. It's a world. It's a whole different world. And we're ahead of China now because of what I'm doing. And I think it's going to be very successful. Mr. So, Ralph, uh, if you just ask the Davos Forum again that NATO countries should spend 5% of GDP on defense, yeah. the United States don't spend 5%. Well, you I, think I it should also so. apply to the United States? We're protecting them, you know. They're not protecting us, we're protecting them. So I don't think we should be spending, I'm not sure we should be spending anything, but we should certainly be helping them. But they should they should up their 2% to 5%, yeah. Mr. Yeah. President, Mr. President, Mr. President, Mr. President, Mr. President you said earlier during your speech at Davos that you would like to see interest rates come down. How yeah. much would you like to see them come down? A lot. You talk I'd like how? to see them come down a lot, and oil prices will come down. And when oil prices come down, everything's going to be cheaper for the American people and actually for the world but for the American people. So I'd like to see oil prices come down. And when the energy comes down, that's going to knock out a lot of the inflation that's going to automatically bring the interest rates down. Are you worried about Mr. President, you said that you would demand 